some sensible things now. I'm in the kitchen with Levi, and you've got the perfect... Well, it's just, it's tasty. I it's a perfect have. winter dish. It's lovely. Indeed. Yeah. It's my spicy mackerel, hot, hot, hot pot. The most fabulous, healthy, um, cheap... Good. Um, after the Christmas, then you spend everything. It's just really good to have something this is really great. nice and cheap so you can Fabulous. get it. Yeah. And Ticks all the all, boxes. All the boxes, all your omega-3 oils and all mm. that kind of stuff like, is right here in this dish. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da -da. <laughs> you don't have to hold your hands up like this. <laughs> no, I think it's good. I'm going to do that. <laughs> so all I'm going to do is just put a bit of lime on it because the lime is just going to help me cook this mackerel right, right through. So I'm going to bang that away sort of half an hour within the fridge. Okay. While that's done, then you can do all your de blinging and everything like that. You've provided me a nice bling bowl we here. We have. We've got Look a little bit of you for all your bits. <laughs> there we are. <laughs> Love it. Cool, friend. Let me just get a quick wash of the hands here. Good stuff. Cool. And now this is for a nice, healthy, fantastic, spicy mackerel. So what we've done, we've marinated the mackerel there and I've Shoot. got some lovely stuff in here. I've got some onions and things that I'm frying off in here. I'm going to add some fantastic sweet peppers in there. Great colours, all the colours. Yes, colors. some lovely colour. I'm going to add mm. some tomatoes in there. And chillies, you can use any chillies what you want. Sure. And again, for the, for, the, for the winter, chillies is really healthy. It helps you to sweat and all that, so it is yep. an healthy Love choice. Love them. Love them. As you know, I've used scotch bonnet here, but you don't have to. They're fierce. And while that's <laughs> frying for a little bit, just get to soften those onions and everything like that in there. I've got some mackerel in there that after you've taken it out for your 30 minutes, it's here. Right. I've boiled it away nicely. So that's just been boiled for 30 minutes, you were saying? For about 15 minutes. For 15 minutes. Yes, okay. just to get it nice and tender. And here you go. And now what I'm going to do is just remove any bones or any yeah. extra flesh that's on there. That's on there. Search for any bones that you may yeah. have in there. Yeah, especially you if you're getting take it that all out. Absolutely, you've got kids in there, so you want to make sure that's all out in there. And I Love. think that one is fine. I'm just going to mm. add that on there. With the rest that I've got. I'm going to bring it over here. I've got some all spice, and as you know, Lorraine, all spice is one of my favorite. Spices. You love I'm gonna, spice. I love it. It's got the flavors about <laughs> five or six different oh, beautiful. flavors on there. A little bit of black pepper on there. Lovely. You know, some people are Maybe a bit funny salt. about fishing, but you could use chicken for this or anything, really? Yes, you yeah. could use. You could use salmon. Sure. You know, you could use sea bass. Mm -hmm. You know, whatever you want in right. there, it is your choice. And sure. then that's marinated. I'm going to add a little bit of thyme. In there, lovely, nice beautiful and lovely. Flavor. It's beautiful, isn't yeah. it? And again, a little bit of garlic in there just to create a bit of flavours in there. In the Caribbean, this dish, I mean, I grew up with my grandma cooking this dish with green bananas. Really? Yes, and That'd I know great. you'll have some Caribbean people looking at this here this morning. Says, Levi, where's your green bananas? These are ripe bananas, so you wouldn't be using these. No. They'll be really absolutely green, so you get that nice hardened flavour on there. So mm. we're cooking away nicely. Once everything is softening there, we're just going to add back our, our fish on top. You know, all spice and everything, and they give it a nice little twirl in there. Mm. Maybe add a little bit more black pepper on there. Sure. It does look good, and as you said, it's really, really good for you. It's cheap, it's easy. Absolutely, absolutely. And all it's so healthy. <laughs> all that sort of oil, that healthy oil, omega 3, is all in there, packed in with lovely flavors. And then finally, as I said, if you don't have those bananas, I'm going to add here, I've got some. Waxy potatoes, which I've cut oh, that's a in good bits, idea. yeah, just yeah. to substitute it from the green bananas. Right. I don't think that you would have green bananas in every sort <laughs> of um, stores up and down the country, but the using just waxy as well. potatoes yeah, yeah, is fantastic. Yeah. And I've just laid them on there. You'd cook that away again for a couple of minutes. And I've got a plate here, Lorraine, that I'm going to plate up for us because oh, I'm starving as I'm well. St I'm always starving. <laughs> it's the joy okay. of my job is that I get fed. It's so wonderful. Pop a bit on by there. the best in the business. Yes. <laughs> and I'd like you to make this oh, at home. Oh, thank you. I'll Absolutely. try. Absolutely. Come on. Well, it's easy enough for me to do. It is, for That's goodness sake. Thank have you. Have a try of that. Have a try of that. Have a great big giant piece <laughs> of the macro because I love. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. That is brilliant. <laughs> That is fantastic. fantastic. It's so tasty. Healthy, cheap, and it's mm. yours. So tasty. It's absolutely brilliant. Now, look, if you do try this, please send us a photo, because I always love to see your recipes. Um, 
I can never get a chance to take photos of what I uh, eat because I eat it too quick. Yeah, okay. Because I on. am a, guzz a guzzler yeah, and a gannet. I'll join you. <laughs> Please do, it's beautiful. 